These are your Harvard University Top 5 Plays of the Week. At number 5, Women's Squash. In her first collegiate match, first year Grace Steelman won a marathon five-game match against Dartmouth's Emma Roberts, capped off by a strong strike to the lower right, freezing her opponent and winning the match. At number four, men's ice hockey. With Harvard up 1-0 early in the third period at Bentley, junior Nathan Crusco made an outstanding pass to sophomore Jack Donato. That sprung Donato and he hit the top corner on a two-on-one for the game-winning goal in Harvard's 2-1 win at Bentley. The win moved the Crimson to 5-4-2 on the season heading into the holiday break. At number three, women's fencing. Down 3-1 in her first home competition, Katherine Bettingfield rallied back with four straight points to win her match versus Tufts. Bettingfield would continue to capture five more victories and help Harvard earn a 25-2 win over Tufts and a 24-3 win over Wellesley. At number two, women's hockey. Lindsay Reid proved again why she's one of the top goaltenders in the nation with this incredible save against New Hampshire. The Wildcats in at point-blank range and Reid keeps it out. At number one, men's indoor track and field. High jumper Dunna Mahown climbed up the Harvard record books against Penn on Sunday, jumping 2.18 meters. That moves him into second all-time in Harvard's list at the indoor high jump. That mark is only the second time a Crimson high jumper has broken seven feet during the indoor season, and it set a new PR for Mahown. That's it for this week's Top 5 Plays. Check out the Ivy League on ESPN for more live and on-demand content. And look for Top 5 Plays to return on January 9th. From all of us at Harvard, happy holidays.